this is the powerful thing about writing tests. I just made like a huge refactor on my code by making something that previously was non-static to something static. And now I'm running my test suite, which is so powerful that it's literally detecting all the problems I have on my code right now do all this refactor. Okay, so I would invite you, like if you are not writing unit tests in your project, just do it right now. There is so simple tests you can write that take literally 10 seconds. Like sometimes people say stuff like, I don't have time to write tests. And the reality is that there is a simple test you can write with PassPeach, for example. You can literally write this, like this get a cert okay. And it's the most powerful test you can have because it will literally tell you that your homepage is working as expected. So, you know, test suite is, you know, tests are really powerful. So if you are not writing that already, just, I would invite you to do that, okay? Adrian is saying something like, at least people should start with smoke tests. Uh, not a lot of people know what a smoke test is. But typically, you know, when you work with unit tests, there is like three layers of testing that you probably should care about. In the highest one is called smoke testing. And you also have in between something called integration testing. And then you have unit testing, okay? Now, if you are starting with tests, the, the something you want to master is this one called it smoke testing. And smoke testing is just tests like this get in a cert that I'm seeing uh, a 200 okay this is like the most simple test you can write if you are doing smoke testing you are literally just visiting your home page and seeing if your own page is working as expected and then you can jump when you are like when you have a lot of smoke testing all over the place something you can do is jump a little bit into integration testing and here you will do a little bit more than this you probably will do something like this well if i create the user for example uh from my factory and if if i try to act as that user uh try to potentially you know um create uh, create an article, for example, or something like this, with a certain information like this. I expect to see this article on a database, like a cert database as or whatever. So this is like integration testing because because I already touches in the different places. So for example, here I'm creating a user, acting as that user, posting something to the articles post, and then checking if the database actually has that. So it's, you know, it's multiple things we are testing at the moment, which is still very powerful. So this is integration test. In the last bit of it is literally unit testing where you would test every single edge case of your application. But before jumping into unit test, you need to master smoke testing and only then you need to master integration testing and afterwards you need to do some unit testing, okay? There is also layers in between, then you can jump into mutation testing for example. Uh, mutation testing, you can jump into coverage testing. There is so many things you can master afterwards, but yeah, smoke testing is the most important thing in the planet, okay? After family. <laughs>